Let's talk about some forensic entomology facts that are actually pretty mind-blowing, and if you're unfamiliar, forensic entomology is the study and use of insects for criminal investigations. If a person passes away and they have drugs in their system, those drugs will affect the growth rate of the insects that feed on them. If they were uppers, the insects will grow more quickly. If they were downers, the insects will grow more slowly. If a body is too decomposed to be able to tell whether or not they had drugs in their system, they can pull samples from the insects that were feeding on them because their bodies harbor the toxins in them. Maggots are very helpful if a body has been moved but there are maggots still left behind. Scientists can analyze them and find out if there is any human DNA inside of them. Say old Carl across the street unalives his wife and then moves her body. When the cops come looking for her, they may not find her body, but if they find maggots, they can pick them up and collect them and analyze them for her DNA. And that right there is very incriminating evidence. One of the first documented cases of forensic entomology dates all the way back to the 13th century in China, when blowflies swarmed all over a farmer's sickle that had been used to somebody else, and thus gave away his dirty little secret. So what I'm trying to say is insects are little crime fighters.